Hello, 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 everybody. How are we all doing this evening? Oh, give me just a second. Let me get all this crap going here. Do, do. You know, I love that intro. Uh-oh. I didn't want you to play again. Play the next one. There you go. Thank you. It's one of the, uh, the older ones. I'm trying to find where all my music went. <laughs> oh, I'm in the wrong, I'm in the wrong folder. That's why. Boop -a -doop. Well, we'll take a trip back in time using this old, oldie but goodie. This is one of my favorite um, little songs that we used to use. But uh, let me put in our uh, other music here. Add to media player, media player. And I have to use. I use this stuff because it gives it gets away from the uh, silence in the background. And. Um, you know, but I found these pu puppies. Somebody made some, finally made some RS 32s, and uh, they're from Trains Forge. And so we're going to reskin them today, or I'm going to attempt to reskin them today because uh, I'm going to make them into Conway Staves uh, locomotives today. Well, we got 11 people watching, but, uh, all right, let me go ahead and say hi to everyone that is here. Hi, Zane. Hi, Mercury Wolf. Hi, Jessica Dog. Kevin Joyner. How are you guys doing today? Hi, Marina. Hagen Bryan. Twin City and Western RR. How you doing? Diamonds HD. How you doing? My lovely, lovely lady. There you are. Go ahead, add the moderation to you as well. You prefer Tain over TRS-19? Tain is good. Try and turn it off and on. Then on again. Many times. <laughs> but uh, we are not live. Um, let's see. Let me... Oh, um... A, th a thing is back. Uh, we're going to be making... Two separate things, one's for Mr. Mako and one for this. If you guys want to be a part of it, just let me know. Um, let me do something real quick. And then we'll get started. We are live. But, alright, so let me transition over real quick. Uh, let me see. Can I get a window capture, please? Window? I should have already done that, but I never... That's the wrong thing. There we are. Okay. Alright, so here is our... Our skin, anyway. And it's really dark. It's the Alpha 1 of it. I could duplicate the channel. As in the R. Uh, what happens if I invert the colors on this one? R, G, B. Then make it, put it above. Whoo! <laughs> oh boy, that's not what I want. <laughs> Duplicate channel. Listen, I don't use Photoshop. And honestly, this is my uh, first attempt at Photoshop. So if you guys know how to use Photoshop, could you please tell me <laughs> in the chat? I got the chat like like as its own window next to me. So let's uh let's try this. It's a butt to use, oh I know. Hello Fidel, how you doing? But uh I'm trying. Uh let's see. Let's make a, just a copy for now. Let's put that above and in. Let's open this one up real quick. Can I make the color a little higher? Okay. Um. Spot color. Okay. And that does not work <laughs> at all. 
duplicate the channel again. Let's try this. Why is it doing that? Uh, whatever. Let's go back to layers. And I need a new layer. So. Uh, no, I've never used Photoshop. I've always used paint on it. <laughs> well, I could cheat the system. But I don't think it would work. Um, let's see what happens if I... Let's see if I cheat the system. Let's let's let me show you. Let me just make it to a uh, properties. Let me turn this into a. Uh, let me turn this into a uh, remove. Yeah, let me remove that. Let me turn this into a full on display capture because I have no idea what I, what the heck I'm doing. So let's see if we can che cheat the system and use something that I'm that I know how to use. See, Photoshop is just really complicated, and some people say it's not. Well, you've been doing it for years, probably. I don't use Photoshop. I've never been a big Photoshop person. Yeah, let's just do this. Copy. And let me go into the Alright, I guess I don't have it anymore. Let's open this guy up real quick. Open. Uh show and explore. Body. And let's open this with paint on that. Because paint on that's really simple to use. Alright. And let's paste that over. Now all we gotta do is just match. Match the file. Make sure, and we gotta make sure we don't go over any, any places. So now we can adjust the brightness and the contrast on this. So let's adjust. Well, I ain't doing nothing. <laughs> Alright, let's see what else we can do. Adjustments, hue and saturation. Well, I guess that's it. <laughs> We're just getting this blank copy. Well, let's see well, if my little cheats, cheat here even does anything. Because I should be able to skin over it. But, let's just see if it does anything to the skin file. I should probably delete these guys real quick. I say we're probably going to have dark... Crappy looking locomotives here in just a second. <laughs> I don't have no idea what I'm doing. Just take the paint out, Matt. Until you learn paint Photoshop. <laughs> I plan on it. What's up, Shooter Simulations? How are you guys doing? I, sa I said we had 16 viewers and it went back down to 10. <laughs> I guess I'm boring you guys to death. With this crap. Well, listen, we're trying to create something. Trying is the key word. I don't know what I'm doing. That's just the thing. Failed to do something. What was that train? Why did you fail? Oh, because I have something open. Because I have Photoshop open. That's why. No. 
Show and explore. Body. Okay. Submit edit. I have something open, I am sorry. Trains. Oh, submitted, okay. I don't think it did anything. It did nothing. <laughs> it did nothing! Anybody know how to use this crap? Because <laughs> I, for, I for sure have no idea what I'm doing. Or we could use, or we could turn it into a C six thirty. See if I can get the skin file from that. But that looks kind of. Would anybody else like to take a crack at skinning these things? Hello, Nathaniel Lee. How you doing? You guys just want to turn this into a build episode and just build something for a minute. <laughs> We just continue working here, and I'll see if I can get somebody to make a skin because I cannot, I can't do it. <laughs> it's too complicated for me. If all these files are just, you know, a bunch of wait, wait, there it is. It's a dark boy. Looks a bit rough. But looks can be deceiving. Hmm. Let's see what we can create. Let's see what kind of monstrosity we can make. Just for the heck of it. Today. Yeah, it's a missing dependency that I made for it. And it kind of corrupted, so I gotta fix it. Body... Alright, so we got that. Let's bring out the locomotive, that way I can see what I'm doing. And let's see what kind of monstrosity we can make here. We got two, three, alright. So we should be able to see... We should be able to see something here. Let's get over here. I just hate that everything is just so dark. If I can make, let's see. Ah! There you are, we can turn the brightness up on it. That made it a little bit better to see. Let's do the same exact thing. Ah, there we are. Uh oh. All right. Now let me save. And just submit the edits and see if it uh, does anything to the locomotive. What's up, Georgia Rail fan? How you doing? A skin file from another locomotive. Another locomotive most likely won't work if I. It, it really won't. I am. Uh, whoa, we just made the matrix. Just trying to catch up on everybody's chat. Uh, let's see. Where's trains? Here we are. Alright, now submit the edit real quick. We're trying. 
we should have an up and running Conway State lo locomotive here in just a second if the, everything works. There's the high hood RS11. Waiting for the edits to take place. There's a Monon. See, I was wanting to do the C628s, but I figured that because of the, uh, the switches and stuff like that, that the C628s would be a little bit too big for some of the areas. And so, why not go with the 32? It's still really dark. I don't know if it's even done anything. Let me see. Let me just open preview the asset. No, it's still just really dark. <laughs> Alright, whatever. But we have something going on here. So let's... We have something that we can cover over. So let's make a multiply. Music isn't too loud, is it? And I also made a rough draft of the locomotive. Over Where you at? Over here. Kinda, it kinda looks like a crappy rough draft, but at the same time, it's kinda what I'm wanting. Um, so let's see what happens if... All I know is this layer is gonna have to be bright. And then be a bright boy. all this in the end this is probably going to look really crap <laughs> which I've sat and taken and took my time with uh, locomotives before and let's see, let's see what happens if I brighten up this light later. Nothing. I probably have to make copies of the layer. It's just really dark, and that kind of looks like poo. Hmm. Can I make the orange brighter in any way? No, it just turns it a yellow. A piss yellow. <laughs> you gotta go orange being as if? Well, I'll catch you in a bit. It's hard to hear you. Okie dokie, I will turn the music down just a tad. How is that? Alright. So, yeah, I have no idea what I'm doing, guys. At all. If anybody knew what I was doing, could they please help? Because <laughs> this is not working. That's just, uh, to me, that's just really dark. I'm gonna expand chat in here pop out chat that way I can have you guys over here and I don't have to create the matrix every time I want to see the chat uh, let's see you seen ghosts nice ghost is a good band to see that is very nice What happens if we... Um, that's a little bit too bright. Glow, that's overlay, difference, lighten, nothing. And we could turn the lighting down though. Now you, you can definitely tell that... Can't get a clear multiply, multiple with that. 
screen. Nah. Let's go back a bit. Wow. Detail. All right. So now <laughs> Oh, this is going to look like poo. <laughs> this is going to look like crap. It's going to look worn down. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I see something. File doesn't completely match. Excuse me. I was a pixel off. On both sides, like maybe two or three pixels. There we are. I think we're good now. Okay. All right. All right. So, and yes, those pixels will matter. Let's um, go into multiple. Let's try it now. Okay. So now it won't look as dark and as as crap. Hopefully. <laughs> I am sorry for this bad entertainment. I am not... Was not completely prepared. I don't know why I am talking in this accent, but I am. Other than that, how are you guys doing today? I'm just trying to come up with something. Because I, want, I wanted this. I need to work on that a little bit more. Get a nice little swoosh going on there. And now let's. get this and I want a, like a little bit of a darker gray where my color palette go there we are like that and the Conway Staves logo All right, so let's see if this does anything to the local. Uh oh, let's see if that done anything to the locomotive. Save as. Where my file go? Oh, I didn't reopen it. That's where my file went. Let's see if this does anything. Yes. Okay. Like a burnt orange, yeah. Looks like a bunch of countries. <laughs> Hey Graham, how you doing? Welcome to my little thing where I'm trying to... Hmm. 
Let's see. Alright, so now let's see if this does anything or am I just wasting my time? Why? <laughs> Why is this not doing anything? Oh... Looks like Photoshop is the only way to go with this locomotive because nothing else that I do is going to work. Well, that upsets me. Well, we got to that, but that was it. <laughs> Well, poo. Anybody else want to? Anybody else want to? Uh... take on the challenge of building this locomotive <laughs> because I am quite frankly stuck I mean I could let's see I could try and see what happens if we open this guy back up nice to GP 60 but I don't know if Reggie will put it on his site if we get it finished and I want to be able to do that. I want to be able for it to be for everybody. Oh, let's see. Let's um, let's open the GP60 back up real quick. Install Conway. Save GP60. Open. Um, show and explore. And open with Adobe Photoshop. Ah, you piece of junk. It's doing that thing where I have to open Photoshop and then open the file from Photoshop because. Oh, all right. Alright, file, open, editing, mesh body, map one. Alright, here's that, channels, pass, there's supposed to be another layer here. There's supposed to be another layer here. <laughs> um, I have no idea if I ha even have. Uh, let's see. Wait, what? I didn't know I had to log in. Registrants, when did you do this? I'm at a standstill. Should we go with the Alco or should we go with uh
Should we go with the Alco or should we go with the con with the GP60? Because if I go with the Alco, I'm going to need somebody to paint it because the Alco is just being stubborn as hell, and Photoshop is being stubborn as hell. It like for some reason it's locking everything, and I can't lock them. Or I can't unlock them anyway, and then I copy them, and then I still get nothing. And the channels, I get nothing. I'm at a standstill. I need... I need help. Let's see. And he's away. Damn. Does anybody know what the hell I am doing wrong? <laughs> All these channels are a headache, exactly. I don't either. I'm at a standstill. Well, you know what? Let's just turn the rest of this into a build. And just start working on, on this. Let me get rid of uh, display capture. And we'll work on... We'll work on the city a little bit more. And then if I can figure out anything that I'm doing wrong or get some help from somebody... That is willing to help little old me. But I don't know what is going on. And But you guys can tell me if, uh, if you know. But for some reason people don't like me. Because of something that I've done. or I don't know. Well, I, don't know I don't understand why. Honestly. I haven't done anything to anybody that I know of. I've lashed out at people, but that's only because they've provoked me. And if that's a reason you're going to hate somebody and talk crap, crap about them, then you honestly need to grow up. Alright. I'm making these guys, too. I, um, Orange BNSF, he uh, helped me get these guys started set up, so we're doing some uh, traffic light business. You ran a red light, which they're going to run. They're going to run. They're going to run them if uh, we're not in driver mode. And which I don't know why I'm getting this detail. Because it ain't like you're going to be able to see it from the railway anyway. But I, for some reason, thought that I'd get really detailed with it.
I think I made a pretty good intersection. <laughs> Well, LTG LTG's lights are for crossings, but uh, I plan on using some of his too. But his are payware too. That means if I put him onto the route, you would have to buy them, which I'm probably am using uh, like other payware items. So I don't know. Maybe I'm gonna put Walmart here because <laughs> why not? Wait, TBS, Walmart. There we are. Whole shopping complex right here. And we'll make uh, all this, and including some out through air. Uh, this this is probably going to be the most detailed city <laughs> ever. <laughs> Which is not really going to be a city. I don't want to put like skyscrapers or anything. It's just a one of those towns that has just about everything. Yo, my little hometown, even though it has about nothing, is getting a steak and shake. It opens Monday. Hello, Fidel. How you doing? If I can make a suggestion about the Alcos, if you're able to reskin them, see if you can add something for the cabs. They're completely empty. It looks weird. They're not outright wrong. Well, they're using the uh, default... Um, They're using the default uh, GP38 thing. They're using the default GP38 cab. Train says it's taking shape. <laughs> Let's see. If they have a steak and shake on download station, steak and shake. Oh my god, there is a steak and shake. <laughs> download, download. Oh god, it's a Dave Snow product, so let's see what happens. Not too bad. I don't like the uh, how it has ground everywhere. <laughs> Not too shabby. <laughs> we'll make our own ground for it. Or we can put the steak and shake over here close to the Walmart complex. And at one time, there used to be a uh, track going through the Walmart complex. Yo, Steak and Check needs to sponsor this video. <laughs> Wait, this one. That one's a little bit more detailed. For some reason, the movement is quite off. But one or two, you guys pick. Two looks a bit, bit more detailed. One or one or two. One or two. One or two. Dos.
two. Yeah. I'm gonna go with two. Oh my god. Why did y'all have to pick two? For some reason, its object is all the way over here. What's that sign? Drive through. Oh! So we can... Put a whole uh, slew of restaurants right here. And then the Walmart parking lot be behind it. Walmart entrance here. We got McDonald's on one side, Steak and Shake on the other. Prime real estate. the entryways. Now, let's try to detail this up a little, a little bit anyway. Let's add in, let's see something. It just made me just play that, just, it just played this song. Why is it playing it again? All right, <laughs> so, um, something definitely wrong there and it just kept adding the same song over and over and over again. I had no idea it was doing that, so here, let's try this again. <laughs> I had no idea it was doing that. Just noticed it was doing it. Alright. So let's play some Bob Ross in the background. Exactly. Put some happy little trees.
All right. Throw some trees and bushes down in the area. Not too sporadic. We're getting somewhere. We are getting somewhere. All right. Actually, have some different music playing, but uh, uh oh, we got grass coming out in the road. Grass, please do not be an ass tonight. You can automatically turn right on red in Kentucky anyway. So these guys are only for that direction. What? Uh, excuse me? Semi truck, what are you doing? You know, that's one thing I have not. KFL? Are you eating KFC now? <laughs> Nutritional equivalent of sm to smoking crack. You're not wrong. But I, I like it. <laughs> Let's put some happy little trees. And happy little bushes. But, um... I haven't even created the town for, or the name for this town yet. All I know is it's the last stop on the Conway, and it's where the uh, the Cooperage is located, where they build the barrels. And of course, it's going to have some other things. Damn, I wasn't expecting this to be this detailed already. Let's see. Uh, let's see something. What is the name of the parking lot spline? I need the parking stripe spline. There you are. I feel a sneeze building. That's not good.
we won't put any tall tall grass like we do over here because these these you know they try to fulfill the customers by keeping their lawn at least cut but they have pretty bushes and stuff everywhere I should put I probably should put another Walmart sign here It's a secondary entrance to Walmart. Kentucky Fried Lizard is a joke. Will there be a depot and turntable for the steam excursions? Yes. Somewhere over through here. <laughs> Because right now we have it to where it's where we're just going right through the town. See, I don't know why I'm getting so detailed over there. You're not going to be able to see it unless you're like... <laughs> but, it's... I guess that's the name of the game. Which was supposed to be my most detailed route ever. And... That's what we're doing. I really like this area here. I really like how this came out. Just some country bumpkin that doesn't uh, doesn't really take care of their home. And they live right next door to somebody who actually does. The little dog playing in the yard. And then a cul-de-sac. Which we built on the last stream. So you're getting pretty detailed, really. Plan on making the... Uh, Excursions to the Walmart parking lot, yes. I mean, there used to be a railroad track that run right through Steak and Shake. You never know. I like how we're, like, uh, I like how everything is square. Like, everything is right here. This is, <laughs> this is the, uh, one, like, maybe two city blocks. That's it. <laughs> Hey look, Walmart truck, Walmart. Why aren't you pulling in there? Oh, funny. No, that's not what I wanted. One of these guys. Cause I need one for here. And one for here. Really? Are you, are you guys even using this thing? Yeah, they're using it. Ah, let's make it to where they stop.
You just got cut off, my dude. <laughs> Damn. That was something. All right. So we pretty much got that. Wait, are you guys using the freaking... Oh my god. <laughs> Whoa. What was that, my dude? I can't do that. Let's do this. Sorry, I've gotten a little bit quiet. Just gotten really into the build. My mission is to create a wonderful looking city. Alright, that's set the channel two. to the channel one so let's keep you let's put you on channel one Let's get these traffic stoppers to actually tra stop the traffic. I think that's all I need in those guys. Okay. See how this works. So they're supposed to change every 20 seconds. If you guys didn't know how to work with the uh, ATLS traffic light system, I don't even know how many people was watching. I'd be probably be down to five viewers, and because you guys are just being bored out of your mind. <laughs> I do apologize. Hmm. See, isn't that cool? Let's continue. Let me get that traffic light system there working. Now we need to get it all going to this guy. Actually, I did forget something. I need these guys. Uh, apparently, I can't grab that one. Well, uh, there we are. And we still need to detail the uh, parking lot for Sega Shake there. Let's 
It's just, it's just a sweet little song, isn't it? That looks pretty cool. What do you guys think? I do those lights and the other ATLS traffic lights. What other ATLS traffic lights? You're teaching drivers how to drift. I am. Uh, what's my favorite CSX locomotive? CSX number 122. AC44 is the first locomotive that I actually got to get inside of and drive, a, drive myself. And that was about... 10 and 11 years ago. The guy would have ca uh, ca uh, called him lots of other things. <laughs> I got really detailed with this area. I don't know why. I'm still not even done. I want to I want to finish this area. And then I got to record a let's play for Mr. Mako's YouTube channel. And actually, it's, it'd be a re-recording of a let's play because I goofed up the first time and had the mouse cursor on it the entire time because I forgot to turn it off like a dummy. But it's okay. Did uh, LTG ever make the uh, shopping cart returns? I don't even know if there were, those were ever made. And and that's just that's just really uh, why am I getting it that that detailed? Somebody help me! I don't need to be getting this detailed, but I am because I want to because it just looks fantastic. Can I copy these splines? I actually can copy these splines. What am I doing? Wait. Does these count as track? They do! Haha! <laughs> Cheat the system! Alright, so. Yo, do they make, y'all tell me if they do or not, if, do they make just a single at light, not one that's like on a pole, just the light itself? Because that would come in handy right now. They do? Is it on the download station, Terry? Let's see. What's it named? Do you know? ATLS 
graphic. Oh wait, ATLS Lite. ATLS double light? No. ATLS lights. I'm just going to download everything that is ATLS lights. Uh oh, I had an error. What was that? ATLS traffic lights, I believe. I think I might got something. The style was black. I think I may I think I may have found something. All my ATLS lights in action. What is Ooh! Ooh! What are these? <gasps> Ooh! <laughs> yes! What we need. What is that? Oh god. I hate these lots right here. Because they look ridiculous. <laughs> Alright, well let's get rid of these guys real quick. Cable. Do I, can I have a single? No, no, no. I just need a single power wire. No. No. I need a... Let's see. Let's put up a... Um... Ooh! I know just a thing. You guys are work... Some street lamps. Boop -a -doop. This guy here. This guy here. You and you. Get rid of. Whoops. Get rid of that. We'll make a, uh, cause there is some of these lights in, like, right, right where I live, you know, those ones that just hang off a wire. So that's what we're doing here. So. Hey guys, tell me, am I getting too detailed? <laughs> I don't need, I don't I don't know if I am or because this is just beyond out of the way. I do however think the lights Let me grab you. Apply, apply. Whoops. There's that. That. Whoop. Nope. Is this is this getting too detailed? <laughs> Traffic lights, but by Newman seven zero six.
This is just beyond anything I've ever done before. That is insane. <laughs> that is just insane. I'm gonna have to make a new, a new thing. Set it up where these guys go off on their own. Let's see. Put them on that. They're on route three. I don't know what I'm doing, guys. Like, I wasn't expecting to get this crazy with it. Ah, oh, crap. have the two arrow guys change at the same time. This is insane. No, I don't, I don't have them on UK phases. Welcome back, it's Unreal. I forgot to do something for you because you are a cool dude and I actually trust you. You're pretty cool. I'm getting like really detailed, and I don't need to be getting really detailed, but I'm getting really detailed. <laughs> mm. This is going to have like this whole different thing going on here. Let's see. Give me one of these guys. No, 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 not you. We need, uh, not a double red, but a double green. Do you have a double green? Do you have a double green? Eh, we'll just use these.
Wait. There we are. You tell me, Unreal. Am I getting a little bit too detailed for this crap? Whoa. I'm, I'm actually enjoying it. Never really built anything really complex like this. So it's quite interesting to, see, to say the least. Suggestion, you should use the JR row markings instead of the ones you're using, as they are on the DLS now. Also, thanks. Uh, I have a red arrow. Hello, Fidel. How you doing? Um, what do you mean the JR row markings? Like, like these guys? Wait, Rail have Beth guns? Excuse me? <gasps> oh, I see. Road markings, here we are. I had no idea that they were on here. Download. Okay, there's those. Dude, I've been needing these. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, they have white single broken? What? Uh oh. <laughs> Whoa. Alright, let's uh, do a bulk asset replay. You. With you. Begin. Nice. And... Ooh. And you with you. Begin. Ooh. Ooh. That looks pretty. Uh, let's see something. <laughs> um, did you download? Bethcon Core Porter skin credit goes to Sure Shot 28. JRG Beth Gun. JRG Beth Gun. How's this boy look? Yo! I ain't too shabby. Had no idea those were on the DLS. You actually find some good things on DLS sometimes. Alright, so, now that he's pointed that out to me, let me continue with this. Yo, where do I find, what's those, 
you always use them. You can never have too much detail. But you have a limit. You have limited sanity. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I have a very limited sanity, but it's not my sanity isn't hasn't broken yet. And I'm building this complex freaking thing. And all these are gonna have a different thing. I'm still not even done. Let me put the lights on this side. I think it should have the same thing. So we got going on here. <laughs> uh oh. Do do do. It might grab it, it might not. Uh oh. Oh, all I needed that for was the height. Alright, so, any suggestions on how to, bre how to bring this road, this road spline, and make it look like it's connecting good with the rest of the splines that I have going on here? Because the rest of this is all just, you know, painted textures and invisible roads. So what would be the best way to converge this road spline into the painting? What would you what would you guys do in that situation? What are you on? You're on two. So put this on channel one. You could lower it down into the ground. What was that? You could lower it down into the ground and then paint over the part that's lowered. Into the ground and create the effect of a smooth transition. Ooh. What's up, Jacob Wong? Did I win the photo contest? I have no idea. I, last, last time I checked, it was uh, 17 to 17. And I was tied with somebody. I think it still is 17 to 17. It is. I'm tied with BNSF Engineer 1104. 17 to 17. Creating the effect of a smooth transition. Welcome to painting. Painting with Koreans. <laughs> I don't have my chef hat.
I'm going to have to give all these their own system. Well, did I just undo what I done? Has Joe ever had a tie before? Yeah, I know. Put this fine over and then boopity boopity boop. Creating the effect of a smooth transition. Yeah, you know, I like how all traffic just stopped from that way. Ah, uh, now it's eighteen to eighteen. Who is who is tagging both of them? <laughs> that time once, but it was broken before Joe called it. Also, nice Dollar Tree. Oh, I know that is a very nice, nicely detailed Dollar Tree. I found it on the download station actually. Dollar Tree DES. It's actually really nice, nicely detailed. Yeah, I don't know what the heck's going on here. No, you can't drive on inside the Walmart, right? Where are you coming? What? <laughs> the National Bank of LTG is the only bank in town. Where are these? Why? Why? 
Stop it. <laughs> Stop that right now. <laughs> Why are you guys driving into the store? To heck with it. I'll make just one. <laughs> it's gonna be that complicated. But yes, the National Bank of LTG is the only bank in that town. <laughs> Logan has all of their money. Alright. Let's see if we can get this complicated system going. Uh, let's see. Yeah, what's those road markings called? You know, the ones that, um, that have the arrows and stuff like that. Anybody know? Because I would sure like to know. Walmart drafter. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Which they now have that thing now, uh, where you can just order online and pick up outside. Which is really stupid, in my opinion. Like, yes, it's really convenient. But you're, <laughs> America's fat enough. Come on. <laughs> Search DES parking on the DLS. TBS also makes road markings pack. Oh, did they? I think I may have them. Let me see. Uh, BS. <laughs> well, 70 mile an hour, 65 mile an hour. Let's see. I'm gonna have to go to the website real quick. The back shops. I need scenery. Would it be in the miscellaneous? Roads. Street barriers. That's new. signs I need those I could use those and the turn signals and lane markings the more you find out all right so we have our complicated traffic light system here we got to set this up I keep putting it off but we need to set it up and it needs to have Okay, Whew. this is gonna be stupid. But why do I keep grabbing trees? I need ATLS one, two, three. I need four of those guys. I probably might need more for the turn signals. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh, oh me, oh my. Because this might need... It needs a traffic stopper here. 
Traffic stopper here. One here. One here. It's just going to have to be on four different systems. And... I have a way of bypassing some things. Alright. Alright, so this is going to be a bunch of stupid, but... That's how we have to work. I also need an ATLS controller. I actually need four of them. Actually, I only need three. Yes. And I know I'd have to create a whole four. Yeah, we'd have to need four of them. And we have to find, uh, get, find the family detailed here. Let's see. Four phases. Phase one. And the rest of them. Let me make sure I'm doing this right. Let me get over here. You on channel one. Yeah, okay. I think I'm doing this right. So, one, on SPL event. Wait, why did I connect that to that? When that's supposed to go to that? Oh, I know why, because, yeah, that's supposed to stop with that. Okay, yeah. 
I, I done confuse it myself. All right, so Maybe this is uh, controller four, which would be. Yo, am I doing this wrong? <laughs> oh yeah, I got I got a whole new set here. Good evening, Jesse. How you doing? The National Bank of Pikeville. Yeah. I'm getting really complicated with this crap. Four. Four, four, set up that light. There's four roots. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. <laughs> oh, I'm an idiot. <laughs> On section four, I finally understand this crap. Oh my god, that was that was stupid. I was sitting here doing this whole complicated thing, and I was making it even more complicated than what it was. Light two on the asset section four. All right. Route one under asset section three. At least think that think that anyway. To root one. To root two. All right. I think I think I finally done that right. <laughs> or am I making it even more complicated than what it was?
Well, here's the thing. I know I only need two slaves. If this was a four-way intersection. But this is a four-way intersection that has turn signals that go into different directions. And so, each light will take a turn. Each section will take a turn. That's what I'm trying to do here. And I think I made it even more complicated than what it has to be. But, anyway. Route 4, phase 2. Um, green, 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 green. SP3, there you go. Two, three, four, five. On route three, two phases. Asset set the channel five, route three. We're getting somewhere. Channel six. Four routes. Two phases. This whole complicated system. One, two, three, four, five, six, and you're on route four. I did a note. This one is controlling root two. I mean, it's supposed to be controlling root four. So, my bad. Root four, channel six. Because that one's on root two. This one's on route one. This one's on route three. Which I believe this one's on. Oh god. Huh. Yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Make sure I was doing that right. I just got these two mixed up. Alright. So now. That's the wrong spline.
I can't remember how I did that down there. Is there any cars coming this way? No, they're all going the opposite direction. I need somebody going the other way. Please. I need to see how you guys interact down here. The shift key is helpful, I know. <laughs> All you would see, Grim, is like cars just <laughs> not knowing what the hell's happening. Um You need to be there. This whole system is completely complicated. <laughs> and it's making me want to kill a baby. <laughs> I, um, unreal, I, uh, I take back what I said earlier. <laughs> My sanity is dropping very quickly. Especially if this, if this whole thing just does not work. I'm going to be very upset. <laughs> All right. I think I have this whole system now correctly ca calibrated. We're going to test it. Yeah, default, whatever. All right. Well, we have a car stopped in the middle of the highway. <laughs> so, that's always a lovely start. But is the whole system working? It looks to be. Oh, we have a truck stopping. We just gotta wait for the traffic light to change. Sometime today, I would love to see if you're working. I wonder if I screwed something up. <laughs> he ran a red light, but 
I think the light should have changed by now. Because these lights are changing. That light isn't changing for some reason. That truck is just all up in that car out there. You can go, you know. Well, everything's working, it's just the lights aren't changing. Something is definitely not right. And thus the sanity meter goes lower. Well, these guys, all these guys are working. So I know that's not a problem. These guys are just not working. It's always clear for anybody that's coming from this way. Just not for anybody else. <clears throat> I'm going to get this working before I end this stream. Wait, that one's changing. These guys are stuck at green. What is happening? <laughs> okay, now that one's changing. Wait, what? Wait, what? Something in this system is not... Right. At all. <laughs> because these guys shouldn't be changing at the same time. And these guys shouldn't be on intervals. Um. Can I big, can I, can I get a big, uh. Can I, can I get a big F? F for respect. Um, Cause something's not right. All right, let me take a look at something. Channel three. Good. Wait. Wait, I think I know my problem. I think I know my problem. I think I know my problem. I think I got it. <laughs> yes. All right. Wait. Nope. <laughs> Why did you two change at the same time? These two shouldn't have changed at the same time. Where's channel five? Route three. Are you set to route three? Yes. Then why did you two change? 
Oh, wait. Something's not right here. <laughs> Something. My. Yes. My IQ is slowly dropping. The more and more this light system does not work. Something isn't right. <laughs> um. Could it be for the seconds for phases? Oh, it can't t Okay, I got it. I got you. Phase one, it will stay green for 20 seconds. Phase two, it will stay green for 20, 40, 60. For exactly one minute. Can I type that? No, I have to click it. That's, that's stupid. So it has to stay red for 60 seconds. That's the problem. They wouldn't on time. So phase one is green for 20 seconds. Phase two and before I'm doing this all wrong again. Because it's a timing. It's a timing thing. They're all on timers. So you treat it as such. It will stay green for 20 seconds and stay red for 60 seconds. And if we refresh the system... Because this is a complicated system. It's a four-way four -way stoplight. Like everybody's... Well, these two are green. <laughs> oh, why did that one turn green? <laughs> are you going to turn green? You're the only one that's not green. Camper van? Oh, I want to kill something. I want to kill something. Okay. We have one light that is green. The rest of them are red. That's how it should be, because that's one on Route 1. He will change. And then somebody else should turn green. <laughs> Does it need to have four different phases? Van got sexually assaulted by the camper van. <laughs> You're not wrong. This is Orange. Does this need to have four different phases? Because they all turned green when this guy turned red. Oh, I want to kill a baby. I'm removing your controllers. That way none of you can change. All right. Let's try this again. Let's put down four new controllers. And... will correspond them to whatever they're sitting next to. You're on channel six. And channel six is plagued by route four. Oh, wait, 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 wait. There does need to be four phases. 
I just don't know how this is set up. And each one will take 20 seconds. On route one, they will have on route one phase one, they will turn green. Route one phase four will turn green. Rest to be stopped. So it needs to do this pattern here. And this here. I think. If this if this doesn't work this time, then I have no idea. <laughs> What are you governing? You're governing this system. Which is light set to root four. You're governing root two. You should be governing root three. I think I think we good. Now we just need to reset the system and see how it works. Yeah, but there's not two roots, Terry. There's four. Ah, uh, I remember the days of the running over the child with the bicycle with the tricycle. Those were good times. <laughs> there needs to be four phases because there's four roots, and so if that if this guy changes. In 20 seconds, we should know. Either that or they're all broke. <laughs> Again. I think it broke again. <laughs> Okay, so that one just changed. What's wrong with you? You're at uh, channel three. Okay, so. Okay. So if you change, you should turn on, or turn green, and then when you change, you should turn green, or whatever. Okay, I think we might have it. <gasps> I think we have it. <laughs> I think we go, golden, pony boy. <laughs> we golden pony boy. We done it. We got the light system, the most complicated thing ever <laughs> to work. I ne I'd never want to do anything like that again. <laughs>
Yes, yeah, there should be. Uh, four, yeah, because they have turning lanes. And so each light takes a turn. Each section of lights take a turn. So it goes in a clockwise fashion. Or is that counterclockwise? That's counterclockwise. But yeah, we finally got this complicated thing that you're not, you're not barely even going to be able to see it from the railroad tracks. But it's there. <laughs> Why am I adding more traffic lights? Alright, so now... This is one of those boys that always stay green. Because you can always turn into Walmart. You just can't go straight or turn that way. That was the most complicated thing I've ever built. <laughs> that was trial and error, ladies and gentlemen. Ah, shit. Here we go again. <laughs> yeah, we should be golden, pony boy. Let me grab... Uh... Oh, also... What is that? That's Denver and Rio Grande. Alright. Let's grab... NS. Because the Norfolk Southern is going to be traveling along the Conway. Just a little tad. It's going to take us a little drive. It's a small drive. JR. G. And over right. The system is working, my friends. It is working beautifully. What's real fun is that I made it. That car's ain't never gonna come down. <laughs> Why did you stop in the middle of the road? <laughs> Good thing they're all just going that way. But yeah, that's working. Why is he on the wrong side of the road? Oh, there, yep, there you go. Yeah, it's working. It just needed reset. That was complicated. Ironically, that makes me want to set one up now. <laughs> like, listen, I, I saw I saw Orange doing it on his little live stream. And I was like, wait, I want to do that now. And yeah, like, uh, 
the, the, this part of the line isn't used much at all, like much at all. Like Norfolk Southern probably comes down here because this is the Norfolk Southern main over here, and the Norfolk Southern comes into onto the Conway branch maybe once a week. And Conway, they they uh, they sell the barrels to send out for uh, Norfolk Southern as well, but they probably only get like maybe a box car or two a week. And Norfolk Southern brings a cold rag. And I'm going to show you guys where the Norfolk Southern is going to take their cold rag. I'm the one that made everyone do it. <laughs> you are. That you are. We have that really complicated traffic light system over there. That can. That cab, you mean? Yeah. Yeah. Listen, that's all I can fit just then. There will be, there will be more room eventually. <laughs> I took a page. I took a page out of uh, out of uh, Joe's book and started putting uh, newspapers and stuff somewhere. Where did I put those at? I think it's over here. In the, yeah, this guy's yard. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, you had a cross. Oh yeah, the, this uh, this cold temple is actually it actually serves um, Conway the CSX. Uh, Norfolk Southern is going to another temple that is going to be on the line eventually. We're going to make this look like that at one time before the Conway existed, before like well before the the barrel the barrel shop and the staves and all that stuff existed. We're gonna act like this wasn't this. It wasn't the uh, switchback that you see. You had one branch here and one branch here. The switchback didn't exist. This was CSX. This was Norfolk Southern. And uh, the Norfolk Southern is gonna, uh, like, I'm gonna clear all this out. We're gonna take a bridge over. And uh, we're going to make it go to another tipple. Like a flood of tipple. And thus, when the Conway was created and bought the line after... And all that, they uh, bought all all the, the trackage. They bought the trackage. Because Norfolk Southern CSX declared they didn't need it. And... Uh, Norfolk Southern and CSX have trackage rights on it for their things it's just that uh, Norfolk Southern doesn't serve this mine making it more complicated by uh, Conway grabbing this mine and the Norfolk Southern grab uh, runs to another mine that was along their old branch yeah I know I gotta fix it There, there are gun shops, thank you, in downtown Conway. Oh, Toronto one? Oh, yeah, I, I know Toronto one. I was at work, but I was on lunch when they won. I gotta, I gotta straighten this track edge. Track edge. I gotta straighten this track up a bit. Lord. I was trying, trying to say trackage and up at the same time. Oh, and if you guys saw my screenshot on the JR Gallery or uh, approach me in Discord or my Discord, uh, this is where that screenshot was taken. Doll arm action!
uh, the uh, where they're doing the road construction. Uh, where's it at? It's right here, El Cantal Hill. Ooh, nothing. Okay. <laughs> Get out of the way, dude! They're gonna run over you! <laughs> I don't know why they're dipping like that, but... That's another one of those complicated systems. We're just doing alright. Yo, do y'all not pay attention to the other traffic? That is pretty sick, isn't it? <laughs> that, they, that they actually... That guy stopped way after the light. I'm gonna move the light down a little bit. I am gonna have to make the, the line a little shorter. Or have... Or make a whole new thing to where the... It waits a bit before it turns green. To a, look at that guy! The actual flag person that has to stop and slow sign. You know that? Yeah, that would actually be pretty sick. <laughs> Where's my train? Oh, he's going through the tunnel. Horn. I love this, I love this, uh, dam area here. That's pretty sick. Not gonna lie, it's a really nice. It's a really nice. Uh, that's a damn nice area. It really is. <laughs> but for too long, all of you will be able to drive along this too for absolutely free. I've never really been into... But I am making uh, Patreon-only content, such as um, one of my routes that uh, kind of started my channel is being moved to a Patreon-only thing. And... Um, I'm going to be starting that here for too long. We have four Patreons already. Um, and you can just subscribe for just one dollar if you guys want to. If you guys just want to watch the series and stuff like that. But, um...
this the Conway route is going to be free uh, for everybody. The next the next project is going to be free for everybody. I'm just going to have uh, something that I'm working al also on as a Patreon only. Thank you. That's the Indigo Tunnel. I forgot what website's on. But it's free. It also comes with these textures. But yeah. The Norfolk Southern will travel along and go on to their mine over here. But currently their mine doesn't exist yet. So we'll be back in due time. But, oh, lordy, I believe that's going to do it for me today, and this, uh, this weekend, if I, if I see, uh, if I see you guys again this weekend, then, well, if I don't see you guys again this weekend, then we'll see you all next weekend, but I do thank you all for joining me today on this little Thing. I know we didn't get to paint the locomotives and this system is complicated in itself but we did get some stuff done got some more details and we'll finish up the detailing of this area on some more live streams uh, but with that being said guys I hope y'all enjoy the rest of your weekend have a happy Father's Day and we will see you all on down the line Bye-bye.